Hello, welcome back. Here is the scenario. We're going to be continuing on with the uh, previous saved. Um, and I am role playing as um, a rapid response um, engineer being dispatched to find out what's happened with this forward base. And um, I'm going to play it straight for as long as I feel like playing it straight to figure out what happened. And uh, as an added advantage, <clears throat> if, uh, if any of you are friends or family or have watched more than one of my video, you probably know that I have a congenital gene defect, whatever you want to call it, and I am extremely allergic to mold. <clears throat> so I wore uh, filtering masks before it was uncool. And I'm going to be wearing it for as long as I feel like during this uh, this gameplay. And I'm going to put the microphone in the mask right next to the um, gasket valve uh, to simulate uh, breathing in an actual suit. So hopefully that's interesting and annoying. So let's let's get going. Inspector two six two six on site. Uh, proceeding with investigation, um, advise special instructions. Inspector 2626, you have discretion on how to proceed. Copy. Proceeding out uh, on discretion. Uh, begin recording. Uh, this was to set up the scenario. This doesn't exist. <coughs> I can see heavy damage to the HAB structure here. We have uh, several panels blown out. Looks like three gla glass panels and uh, five iron panels. Oh, we've got a skull. It seems like the previous tenant has uh, died. The uh, beacon is here and activated. Oh, the auto wave is completely destroyed. The uh, found the bot here. The bot is completely powered down. It is unresponsive. We'll check that out at a later time. Finding equipment here. It looks like their oxygen tank is intact, but it is empty. Uh, looks like there's been a blowout over here on a shed-like structure, uh, but atmospherics appear to be intact, uh, but a uh, liquid network here has been completely damaged. A hole in the floor, so I'm assuming this is where the uh, explosion occurred. Okay, I'm now proceeding to look out at the blast field here. Well, we found some iron just sitting around. Light damage. Uh, wreckage of the auto wave. Approximately uh, 19 meters from the hub. We'll take that in for evidence. The landing vehicle is intact. Uh, many of the components seem to be have been removed and used to build the hub. Uh, very large crater here. Probably had no responsibility in the accident. Uh, mining activity and uh, more parts appears to have some just general wreckage here 41 meters from the accident I'll pick that up for evidence <coughs> and 
there's a large impact crater here with uh, lots of ore that appears to be untouched. The operator may have been sourcing elsewhere. Doesn't seem to be very many suit pieces here. More mining activity. Very haphazard. I think that's about as much uh, wreckage as I'll be finding in the immediate vicinity. <coughs> More minor activity here. Yeah, that seems to be about it. I'm not getting a very big picture here. Uh, with the robot deactivated, we can't really access its memory. But it does appear like the robot did drag the remains of the operator to the hub and activated the, uh, the emergency beacon. Oh, here's some more. Some more auto layer wreckage immediately outside. The uh, explosion seems to be about two meters wide, two meters deep. It's uh, interesting that the explosion occurred probably around that uh, that oxygen tank, but the oxygen tank remains intact. An interesting happenstance. Oh, there's the there's the poor bitch's uh, clothing. Yeah. Okay, let's get this thing buttoned up. I don't want to die like this idiot did, so I'm going to get everything sorted out quickly. Last contact base. <coughs> Rapid response investigator 2626 on site. Initial investigation uh, completed. The uh, operator is dead. The uh, robot is deactivated. The site is in uh, major disrepair. Uh, no holding. Um, uh, no holding atmosphere and uh, proceeding with repairs. Please advise. <laughs> Copy that. Proceeding uh, as desired. Own discretion. Oh, let's get up in here. I guess I have to take those down. Seems like these iron windows uh, stayed intact. Uh, this must be the greenhouse area. Let's continue here.
power low. Let's go grab a battery here. Uh, no, not a battery. We're just at 50%. <coughs> is that the right way? That is not the right way. Oh, is this been blown out? Oh no, that's there. Why can't I see the lines? Oh, there we go. I'll leave that the way it is. I'll fix it later. I don't want to fix it right now. Okay, I gotta fix you. Oh, this bad news bears. Taking a nose dive. Let's get rid of you. Don't need a bad penny sitting in our in the our new lovely oh more wreckage. What's this of? More wreckage of the other way. The other way seems to have taken a pretty big hit. Oh, here's more stuff. We'll just throw it here in this makeshift silo. Oops. Just for now. So damage. That was annoying. That was majorly annoying. Super majorly annoying. Okay. Button this up. Okay. And then you can go somewhere a little more sensible instead of just like sitting out in the open doing nothing. We do have an auto lathe on site. I didn't think there was one. And uh, we did have doors, correct? We were given doors. If dispatch didn't send me doors, I'm gonna be kind of pissed off. Okay, right, dispatch sent us doors. He says, the first time in the history of mankind, Dispatch has done his goddamn job properly. There we go. Now we have effective seal in the hab. Take a look around. I believe we do have an interesting choice to put a window here. Okay, let's get rid of the rest of this uh, damaged crap. Well, remove this panel here because Seems like it's not super necessary. Hydration critical. And uh, we are going to start dying of dehydration in a minute if I don't get this stuff buttoned up. That may be difficult at this point. Uh, That's the wrong side. This is the right side. Oh, well, looks like we have some silicone there on the ground. That might come in handy. That's the wrong button. But that's fine. It's not like I'm going to die here in a minute or anything. There we go. Okay, here we are on a pressure crunch, and uh, dilly dallying around like an idiot. Uh, 
Now it does seem like the uh, solar panel is intact, but it is detached from the power center. So let's uh, let's try to revive that a bit here. Where is this going? Okay, I think I know. Nope, that is the wrong kit. Where is the power kit? Must be in the other box. There she is. Okay. Nope, we don't want that. Uh, my OCD will not allow me to have that opening the other way. There we go. Uh, let's wire up this bitch. Uh, my mood is rapidly decreasing as I'm thirsting to death. Okay now. Let's get a battery. How did that charge? Oh no, I didn't grab it, that's why it's charged. Never mind. Close you up. Close you up. And this time, we'll do with the smart thing and jump as we throw this in. Did that get in there? Mm, yes, it did. There we go. Cleared it out. Let's reconnect the solar panel and hopefully we'll get some... We'll get a chance to uh, hydrate up before I completely lose my mind. Are you powered? You are powered! Good for you, buddy! We will need to disable the... Uh, atmospheric system in the main hab because uh, we just don't have the uh, atmospherics as yet. Here we are. I'll grab my own oxygen tank here and hopefully not die in a funnel like the last idiot. Now that is great. Seem to be playing catch with our uh, with our lifeline. Thank you. A weird little bastard. Now well, we need our survival kit. Here is our survival kit right here. Close that. Get lost. Close you up. Okay, here we go. Pressure levels is increasing. Open up the low helmet. Pressure. Oxygen low. Take a nice Oxygen drink. Oxygen low. Oxygen low. Oxygen low. <sighs> Oxygen low. Let's bring that up to normal O2 levels. There we go. We are stabilized. No rest for wear. Oh, here we go. Have the suit off. 
can you take a nice breath here? Maybe we'll have some chow. Oops, dropped the can. Whew. What are our O2 levels in here at? We're at uh, six megapascals. We might have enough to fill the hab up, but uh, somehow I don't think so. Might have to find some nitrogen ice to uh, offset our oxygen needs. But let's save some power here. At this point, we are well into the midnight. Let's take stock of some of our provisions. We have the uh, standard construction set here. And uh, the extended construction set. Don't need the uh, uh, arc furnace, but uh, we brought it anyways. We have another solar panel, even though we might not need it. They have portable hydroponics. We'll need that. Seems like the on-site one is gone. A few things of water and some food, some more food, and some seeds to get us started. Uh, we have uh, three hearts, uh, three free hard suit backpacks for this, but uh, that probably won't offset much. We have our rover out there that is now useless. It just got us to the site and. Uh, um, it's not going to move again. It's completely in, in, completely shut down, even though it's fully charged, but it is just a useless mess out there, like it always is. Once we're done with our breather, we'll get going a little bit more. Yeah, we're about done with the breather. Let's save it on oxygen here. So it will reset the microphone so it's not like in my mouth. Oh shit! Should I have to close the valve here? That might affect us a little bit in the future. God damn, what's occurring? We are having some kind of problem here. And my rubber is all in my face. There we go. Well, I don't have... Uh... What in the hell is going on? What in the hell is going on? Uh, we just got a pressure in the in the air lock here, bouncing up and down in, uh, at 90 kPa, and it's not doing dick. Let's just open up the rest of the hand, because I'm not screwing with that right now. Fuck that knife. What the? Okay, whatever. Let's just put this on. So we don't have to deal with crap. There. Stupid bastard. Hey! Let's see where her equipment has survived. Battery is completely done. We've got a completely full race tank. We've got good oxygen. We've got two good. Uh, Freakers here. It's uh, not so bingo as we want it to be. 
let's check her. Oh, got some gold. We're rich here. Hey, happy us. Got some copper. And, uh, oh, this is hers down here. Seems like all of her tools made it. And we've got an atmospheric analyzer. Yay for us. Uh, we don't need her tool belt right now because we've got our emergency tool belt on us. Let's just see what this pressure is at. Might be very more. Got 10 kilopascals in here. That's not terrible. So we'll steal the uh, car down here. Throw the battery on the floor for now. And uh, uh, this cursed thing or blob that can be thrown over there. Now we'll see if we can get the hell out of here. And actually depressurize this goddamn airlock properly. There we go, now it's going down. What in the hell is going on with our suit pressure? Oh, that's probably what's going on. What the hell is going on with me? Whatever, let's just go. Okay, so we are going to need this all over soon. Yeah. Where did the other ones go? Oh, uh. We'll just uh, pretend like I didn't put a, a uh, large piece of manufacturing equipment in a backpack. Yeah. I didn't think about that when I was setting up the scenario. Here we go! Continuing forward. Or continuing on, I should say. Oh, looks like she left some of the equipment on. That was an interesting choice of her to do, but she was killed. Uh, we don't have a charge yet, but uh, we're also not very... Um, we're not, we don't have a lot of sun right now. Uh, actually, what I'm going to do is I'm going to look for some nitrogen ice. Because I would like to have a pressurized room to live in. God damn this day, all the time. Let's put a turbo pump in here. I forgot to check to see if she had a uh, mining rig on her, a mining drill, but beggars can't be choosers. Uh, this is not nitrogen ice, I don't think. I think this is I think this is oxygen. Yeah. So we'll just steal some oxide here. Oxalate does have nitrogen in it, even though it really doesn't in real life. Actually, oxalate doesn't really exist in real life. That is more than enough. There we are. Let's get our hab up to some pressure. I can get in here. Okay, there we go. Here we are. What is... We're at 20 kPa. Let's get a little bit more. We will release her waste tank valve here. Uh, 
put it in here to completely drain at some point. Okay, so we're at 50 kPa, and it is 12 degrees, so that's not going to be super hard on our bodies. Oh, helmet down, and we'll save battery here. Okay, let's get ourselves some workspace. Uh, this is a locker. Let's get some lockers up here. Um, put the poor bitch's clothes over here. There we go. Make sure this is completely emptied. And it is not. There we go. Got ourselves a nice uh, extra thing of... Uh, oh, we can shut the beacon down now. Where's the beacon shut down? Oops, the beacon was shut down. We'll just uh, ignore that for continuity. Suit is nice and empty. How damaged is it? Oh, it was pretty damaged. Okay, we've got two, no, we've got one mining belt, and we've got a welding torch in it. That's not helpful. Not helpful at all. We've got a tool belt. Oh, we'll steal the, uh, the coil of wire out of it, but uh, I think I like my red tools better. I'll just keep those. Uh, those will degrade eventually. They are made out of much softer metal. Just because we needed to print them off quickly. Uh, we've got the poor girl's helmet here. Uh, let's just put these in a vaguely organized fashion. Is the light on in that? No, I don't think so. I've got a nice spare uh, tablet. Let's... Uh, Let's take that tablet, and we will keep the um, fully uh, repaired one as a as a backup. We don't want that. Uh, I'm gonna stick these here for now. Don't need to carry them everywhere. Oop! Nice auto lathe. Now let's take this auto lathe down because. It's useless sitting there. I'm half dead. Uh, is that good? Yeah, that's good right there. Okay, now this poor woman's skull we're gonna keep because uh, the family's probably gonna want something to bury. Hydration Ooh, critical. I did not know you could do that. Oh, I need a drink of water. Uh, damn it. I'm getting low on water already. Uh, you're actually in good condition. Nope, that's not what I want to do. I want you over here, thank you. We're going to put you here, put you here, and stick you back over there. Isn't that nice? Okay, we got a dead soldier. We'll charge that dead head up, and uh, we'll leave it out in the open here. Okay, let's put out our... Um, not that one. It's that one. Let's put out our hydroponics, which was not that one. But we do need our fern seeds and our potato seeds, because we're going to need to... Uh, plant them once we're deployed the uh... Here we go once we've deployed the hydroponics Because we do need food and we do need breathe Oh That kind of move quickly around the hell? 
kind of offset there. We'll plug in some water. We are not at a good temperature, but uh, I don't care. I, I don't want to starve to death. So we'll just try to make do. There we go. Where's our water bottle? Turn the light on here so I can see something. Uh, what else do we have to look forward to except for death and taxes? Let's just kick this into shape here. There, kicked into shape. What is our temperature at? We are at 13 degrees C. We are not in a good mood, but we are... Uh, not in a dire situation anymore, neither. See, she has in her pockets. We've got a credit card that we are going to steal because for some reason, uh, my credit card. What is my credit card? Say? Okay, we're just going to delete that so we're not cheating. Continuing. Ooh. Here's the drill. We've got the drill. Uh, this pickaxe can go all the way to hell. And when it reaches hell, it can then fuck right off. Because... No, that's not what I wanted. Yeah, we're going to take our tool belt. And we're going to put our pickaxe in there because it's dumb and stupid and uh, I think that's it yeah that's it cool now we need to button this bitch up some iron sheets no not you you uh, hmm I seem to have misplaced my iron sheets. Got some iron walls here. Got some extra iron walls. And I have misplaced my iron sheets. Are they here? Let's close this first. I have misplaced my iron sheets. This is not going to be good. Um, if I have completely lost them, I will die. Let's check the uh, the poor girl's... Go away. Let's check the poor girl's pockets here. Nope, not in here. Nope, not in here. Okay, we are going to have to we're going to have to call for an emergency evac if we can't follow if we can't find these uh, these iron sheets because we won't be able to do anything unless we dismantle part of the uh, hab. Oh yeah, we are in uh, a semi dire situation here. Oh my god, I. I Looked right at them. Looked right at them, and I didn't didn't see them. So I guess we are <coughs> not paying attention here. Temperature high. It's not that high. I miss the old uh, the old uh, Australian voice. Not Australian, the old uh, New Zealand voice that they had. Yeah, they gotta change everything to American, because I guess the Americans rule everything in the world. And uh, not just the world, but it seems like they rule everything in the. Uh, Rest of the solar system, too. Hey, 
There we go. We got a functioning auto lathe. Our situation is looking up slightly better. Do it till Ooh, online. There we go. Happiness and rainbows. Okay, where is that oxygen bottle? Um, let's take that O2 bottle and we'll shove it in here to fill it up. Perfect. And then we'll get the suit. And we will stuff the suit full of magic. Uh, we're going to shut the whole thing down first. Where is that waste tank? There's the waste tank. Ah, we can have a small amount in the waste tank. That's fine. That will be our emergency gear for now. And uh, we are running low on power. Why is that red? Why is that red? What is draining power? Something is draining power in the hab. Well, let's cut all power from outside off. Just to make sure we're not uh, draining too much here. And we're draining a lot, but... We are going to have to find out. We're going to have to find out where that vampire is. But uh, for now, we'll hydrate up. I don't know where I got that from. Must have been just sitting on the ground. Okay. Battery. Good battery. Oh, I must have accidentally switched out a battery, didn't I? Now, I do want this emergency suit here to have a battery in her. Is everything off? Everything is off, so... Uh, I got some more tape. We'll put that in the survival kit. Right here. Okay, we will shove this stuff in the uh, auto lathe for now. Got another nice little battery here. Why are you so low? I don't see anything that that's connected to. Unless the auto, unless the uh, the uh, the smelter outside is on, this is zero. So I'll just shoot you over here for now. You did your job. Thank you very much for leading me to this site. You little robot also did your job. Uh, we'll try to get you online later. Can I force feed it a battery? Hmm. Can't really force feed it a battery, so it's gonna be kind of difficult to get you back online if you have no battery if you have no power. Let's just stuff you in a corner here. Forget that you exist. And atmospheric analyzer. Oh, I put the tracker in there. So you put the analyzer back in. There we go. 
So, we are cleaned up. Let's see if we can't put you over here a little better. There you go. Sorry about that, dear. Cool. In darkness, in darkness, but everybody seems to be growing quite nicely. We will need to start collecting resources. Hmm. See if we have enough for the uh, hydraulic bender. Nope, we need copper. I thought we did have copper. Nope, that was gold and nickel. I just lost battery power. And we're not charging, so I am not risking um, more battery. I thought for sure I saw copper somewhere, didn't I? I picked up copper. I remember saying that I picked up copper. But I guess I did not. Or... No copper in you. Are, is it just me, or are these moving further and further over every time I pick them up? Uh, no copper in here. Yeah, I really think those are moving further and further over every time I put them down. Absolutely. See if we can do a sneaky deaky here. Nope, can't do a sneaky deaky. Okay, whatever. So, let's just put this away. These batteries will need charging at some point. Uh, I think there's a charger on uh, in the construction kit. Not that construction kit. Here we go, battery charger. I'll just stick you right in the middle here. It's kind of confusing the way it's offset. And we will cut into the power cells here, power system. Cool. Oh, we're charging now. I'll suck all the energy out of that uh, battery there. I'm not going to risk going outside. I'm not going to risk going outside until I have battery. And if I don't have battery, I'm going to have to call for an evac. Because I'm not risking my life for this pissant Mickey Mouse company. I've already lost one operator out here. I don't need to be the second one. Okay, that battery is completely dead. And, uh, how much CO2 do we have in the atmosphere? Not much, only about 1%. That should be enough to keep the, uh, uh, the plants going. Oh, look at them grow.
we're almost up to 20 degrees C. We are going to need to start uh, controlling our thermal input into this room uh, very soon as the uh, solar forcing continues on us. Let's just check to see what that battery is. 9%. This is not going well for us. We do have we do have some charge going on here, so let's uh, let's pull the batteries out of all of the other person's equipment here. Oh, that's completely gone. Uh, where's the tool belt? Tool belts right here. No, that's the actually. Let's put these in in the uh, the backpack. Just save on as much space as we can. That is our backpack. We don't want to move that one too much. That's got nothing. Battery. Battery. There we go. Two more batteries out of the deal. And we'll move that back down here. Now, change the place right there. just happened what just happened did the backpack go in the clothes backpack went in the clothes I don't want the backpack in the clothes yeah let's put the clothes in the backpack though there we go now we've got a few more bats here that's the, that's the wrong button. Okay. Oh, it is charging. Good golly, here we go. We will uh, uh, re helm it up. Okay. I actually might stop you for this part of the roleplay real soon because this microphone's really in my mouth constantly. There you go, is this on? This was not on, so where is my power leech? I do not know where the power leech was or is. Ooh. Oh, we got seeds out here. Uh, kites and eggs. Okay, so I did see that doesn't exist. Uh, oh, I just looked at it. Solar panel. We'll put a second solar panel up just because we can. And I am almost positive that I saw... Oh, uh, we forgot to bring glass up with us, but... Uh, that's not a worry at this point right now.
we will finish off that install in a second. Now, I am 100% positive that I saw copper somewhere. I am, I am almost 100% positive. Waste tank caution. Okay, you know what? We are not role playing with this mask anymore. This is goddamn annoying. And I and I'm sure once I look, once I check the audio, it's gonna sound annoying. But that was fun for a few minutes, wasn't it? Now I can actually like scratch my freaking nose. God. Ugh. I gotta leave that in. <laughs> So, uh, astronauts, when they're in space and they got to scratch their nose, there's actually a little um, patount inside their helmets, and it's got a little bit of foam on the end of it. So they actually, like, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to use, use the microphone. So they actually reach forward on the little patount, patount and they go against the little piece of foam. <laughs> okay, let's continue role play here. Or not, because we have already been screwing around for almost an hour, and that's long enough for a video. There's another uh, almost hour's worth of footage, but we'll split that into a second part. So hopefully, I'll see you next time, or something. <laughs>